Okay, so I take a look at a lot of people's resumes because they asked me to, and I'm definitely not a resume writer. I'm not a professional resume writer. I do my best to help, just to help based on my corporate experience. So, of course, this is really just to help you if you're one of those people that more or less does their resume on their own and you're not paying a career coach or a resume writer to do it for you. One of the things that I thought, you know, when I was sort of taught this about 15 years ago, I thought this was kind of taken care of by now, but 15 years later, it looks like not really. A lot of people are still doing it. So what you want to make sure you do when you're putting the description for each position is to qualify or quantify it in some way. Granted, there's a few exceptions here and there where it just may not make all that much sense, but that's really kind of maybe 10% of the time. Most of the time, you really want to qualify or quantify. So let me take you through this really quick and show you what I mean. And I decided to use my own resume, and I'm sure this could probably be picked apart a little bit as well, but nonetheless, so if you look at what I've written here, what is the main thing that comes across as not being all that great? Lead product development for leading category, innovation lead for driving new products, manage spend, direct sourcing turnkey relationships, increased speed to market, oversaw successful transition, reduced annual costs. So the trouble is that none of these things are qualified or quantified. Now here's a better way of doing it. So if you take a look at the second version of this where I've done some highlighting for you, lead product development for $300 million a year category, innovation lead for a $650 million category, and reduce pipeline churn by 30%. Managed $125 million in spend. And if you look at the last one, reduced annual costs, and a lot of people do this in their careers depending on what it is you do, of course, but just putting that you reduced annual costs isn't really enough. You want to showcase it with some numbers. Reduce annual costs by $10 million over a five-year period. So now you know a much better way of taking your basic resume and moving it forward by just simply quantifying and qualifying what it is you write in your job descriptions. And I wish you a lot of luck. So send me your comments and questions, and each week you'll get a chance to win a copy of my book. And I'll answer your comments and questions during the QA video for that week.